because they just refused me service because I wouldn't wear a mask into their store, even though I have a medical condition that exempts me from the, uh, the thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stand out here and do a little video on it, and then we'll go from there and see how they like it. Like I said, this is Dragon T with Dragon Fire News, South Carolina, and I'm out here doing a quick story on Verizon and the fact that they're refusing people into the store because they don't have masks, even with medical conditions. They're refusing people into it. situation is, what they can say or do, but this is a, that lady right there refused me service, said that I can go to Walmart or somewhere else to pay my bill when this is where I pay, uh, get my service from, and they want to argue with me and tell me that my medical condition isn't good enough. Yeah, it looks like more people is having problems with it, too. Forcing people to wear a mask. That, is that the new norm? You got to have a mask on to do anything around here anymore? It's ridiculous. And this guy here with the security is all up ready to do something about it.
sick and tired of my life being turned upside down for something that is not even really that bad. So I'm going to boycott Verizon Wireless. I will take my service elsewhere and do what I have. constitutional rights. So 
we're going to boycott Verizon Wireless for refusing service to people without a mask. According to the law, you have every right to not have to wear a mask if you're un- exempt by medical uh, conditions. It doesn't matter what business you're going to, as long as you have a reason to be at the business, you should be sued. Oh, there's other ways to pay your bill. I don't have a credit card to pay my bill any other way. I shouldn't have to go to another establishment to pay my phone bill. This is fucking ridiculous. These people want to act like they control the world with these mass bullshit. Ah, I hope he calls the cops on me because I'm going to stand out here as long as I need to. and try to have me arrested or removed from the pro- uh, public truck, which I will not do. I have every right to be here. Public sidewalk, public easement, public property. And that's a person right there. Or you can go pay your bill somewhere else. You don't have to do it right here. But this is where I pay, I, my services are paid for at. I have every right to come to the place I pay my service. Oh, but you're not going to accept cash, huh? What? You don't accept cash? I can't believe that shit. These guys just became my story for today. Refusal to serve for service to get my phone turned back. Outside. What's that? Are you kind to go back to your car? No, I don't have to. 
Yeah, I don't have to be talking to you. You're like, right, and I don't have to talk to you either. Law, you don't I don't do care. That. The law can't do anything. I'm on a public easement. Mm. And pu a public photography is not a crime. It's first, first Amendment constitutionally protected activity. Yeah, I get, I get all of that, but you're making yeah. it harder on everybody else. I don't... I'm not making nothing harder no, on you. You're making it much harder on Well, me. if you don't want to be on camera, guess what? Don't come to approach a cameraman. Hey, everybody, we got an uh, F you from this gentleman. Yeah, you need to calm down, dude. It's not that big a deal. Excuse me? You wear, just put on a damn mask to let you in. You know that. I don't have to wear a mask. That's just it. It's hey, against my saying. constitutional rights. Hey. I'm and I have a medical condition exempting me from the mask. Hey, I don't know what, what medical condition. What's the medical condition? Well, th that's a HIPAA violation. If you ask me, my what my medical condition is. Nigga, you're retarded. You don't know what this, you don't know what you're talking about. You, oh, excuse me. You didn't answer my question, so you're dumb. Uh, you, you said you asked you me what medical condition I have. Tell me. I don't have to tell you. That's the thing. Well, you're making it harder on me, but uh, well, I, I can just hard on you, on pal. Hey, bro. Guess what? It's a constitutionally protected activity, and you can't stop oh, me, and neither can the police. Constitutionally protected. Yes. I think you've been studying Freedom of press, oh. brother. Press? Are yes. You a journalist? Yes, I am. I have a, I have my own channel and everything. Oh, you mean you're a freelance journalist? Yes, I'm a freelance that journalist. That means you're not real. Okay. Oh, excuse me. So you're saying a freelance journalist is not real? Are you getting paid for this? Yeah, I am. Okay. Then that, 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 that not make me real? Is it worth it? Yeah, it is. Thank oh, you. Really have a good day. Good. Have a good day. And we will be back to my story. It was uh, rudely interrupted by a customer of Verizon saying, oh, if you just go back to your car, it's not that big of a deal. What is a big deal to me? And by law, they can't stop me. We don't use bad numbers. Oh, what identification number then? Officer Devine. My CRT number through the city is 534. It's uh, 693. All right. What can I do for you today, uh, gentlemen? Uh, we got a call about an issue with inside the store. I wasn't inside the store, so. Or, okay. Well, what, what's going on today with you being here? Let's well, I'm doing a story on them. Okay. okay. Uh, them refusing business to people without a mask. Okay. Uh, I have a medical condition that uh, can exempts me from them wearing a mask. And they're saying that they will not accept cash or so they're saying that because I don't have a credit card to go and purchase it online that I can't get my service turned back on okay. because I don't refuse to wear a mask because of my medical condition, okay. which is exempt according to the law. Okay. And they're still going to refuse service. That being private property, they can still I understand that, them. but I can also do a news story from public property. Okay. Um. That's all there is to be said. I'm on public property. I'm not on their property. Public property. Okay. Um, and, and public photography is not a crime. Cannot be de 
seem suspicious because it is a constitutionally protected activity. I'm a, I'm I'm a member of the press. We didn't say that we. I know. I know. I'm not. I'm just. Right. I'm just. I'll, I'll, I'm I'll covering, covering my bases before I start hearing the cops explaining. Tell me what what I can can't do. Here's the deal and all that because I don't need to listen to it. Technically, this is a consensual conversation. Yep. You have no reason. I didn't break the law. I haven't by- broken any crime, done any, committed any crime. So this is a con- consensual conversation. They can't stop me from filming out here. Neither can you. Okay. Uh, my name's Steve. What's, what's your first name? I'm not going to divulge my information. I haven't okay. broken crime. What would you prefer I call you? I'll call me Dragon T. That's my reporter name. Yeah. All right. That's what I was looking for. Something. Right. You know, you say it's a consensual conversation. It is. Can you do me one favor? What's that? Can we take a couple steps this way. I'll stop that. I'll stop at the uh, pole. That's where the, uh, no, no, I'm saying I just want to get you a couple feet away from the road. That uh, I stop at the pole. That way, I'm not on their property. Okay. While we're talking, can you just take a couple steps? We're this way? we're asking you to. You're, so you, you're, you're, we're if I get right? trespassed well, because no, of that, no. then I have it on video. Well, no, we're I just don't want. So we're not. I just so don't want somebody somebody not be paying attention and put right. on the curb and us okay. get bumped. Right. Um. The. You, I would have, and I'll be the first one to say I'm not exactly sure where property lines end would be if they have. The utility poles is where property line is. Are you willing to go down to that utility pole? No. From the utility pole to the street, there's a public easement. Okay. 33 right. feet from the center line to the uh, the thing. They have to allow somewhere okay. to walk. Where are, you, where are you parked? It doesn't matter where I'm parked. You have no right to ask that information. Okay. Well, they want us to place you on trespass from their property. I'm not on their property. That's, that's what I had to make sure of. But for me to trespass... My for... vehicle is not on their okay. property. That's all I was making sure of. Yeah, I know. Um, for me to place you on trespass, which is what they want as a property owner, I have to have your ID. No, you don't. On your ID. No, you don't. Or I need your name and date of birth. No, birth no, you here. don't. Not for a trespass. Yes, no, you do not. I know the law, man. Trespass. I got it written down. I know the law. Trespass, you do not require... I didn't break the law. I'm, I left the property before they... Being private property, they can place you on trespass because... But, but being on trespass doesn't require you to get my identification. How you ask you ask me to leave, and if I don't leave, then you do a formal trespass, which is written on paper. I know the law, sir. No, I'm gonna stay right where I'm at. That way, I'm not on your pro- their property no more. I'm not gonna uh, have a. Oh, you're on their property now. Like I no, just, that wasn't the reason I had you step over. Right. But I'm far enough that if people, I'm old enough to know that stay out of the street and not get hit by cars. I just dropped it to overly cautious. All right, that's fine. I have just one question for you. Uh, you. I don't answer questions, man. There's no point in it. Well, I was just asking, were you harassing the other customer? No. Okay. That's, no, that's all the I other did. customers approached me. I didn't approach okay. anybody else. Okay, and that's what that's all I wanted yep. to ask. That, that simple, that, simple. That's not easy. answering a question. That's telling you a statement. Okay. I didn't approach any customers. Oh, I did ask one gal. She uh, was refused service because of no mask. That's not harassment. That's asking a question. And as a reporter, I have every right to ask questions. Yep, you can. Huh? You can, no. I'm yeah, not. all right. Well, that's what I thought. And there's nothing that you guys can say or do about it. I mean, by law, I'm not breaking it. I'm actually following the law.
understand what I'm saying. RAS, RAS, there is no RAS. Public property, public photography, it's all legal. The miscue. That's why I, I came, where your I car came was. to the store to try to get my pay, uh, bill paid to get, and then. But you were doing all. No, I wasn't. Didn't have all this when I came up. Okay. And when they refused me service, told me I could go pay my bill somewhere else. Okay. I'm like, but this is where I pay my stuff at. This is where I get my service at. Okay. And they all refused right. me, so I told them to f off, and I'm going to go somewhere okay. else. Now you do understand if you go back in, they can't. Yeah, really I know. I know. Okay. I, hey, right. I know the law. As long as you understand. I got a book with the laws in my pocket right, right. here, we're man. Good, then we're good to go. Right. Yes, sir. Thank you, officer. You guys have a good day. Yes, sir. And, and just, just. For... I don't need no explanation. No. No, no, no. no. I, I was just going to say, just watch your language, whatever. Um, actually, I, I read the laws, and according to what the sheriff says, if I'm protesting or doing something to that sort, I have every right to cuss the public. He, uh, yeah, because I'm not being. As long as I'm protesting, and, and, that law is unconstitutional. I have freedom of speech. You have freedom of speech, but and, and uh, it protects offensive speech, not uh, speech that people aren't going to be offended by. So if I say something that I cuss, I'm not in this school zone or okay. a church. All right. I know the law. I read it. All right, yeah. I read it extremely. I wouldn't be out here doing it if I didn't. I don't break the law. You have a blessed day, sir. You do. Have a good day, officer. And there you go, everybody. You have it. They're calling the cops on somebody for doing a constitutionally protected activity and wanted me trespassed. But since I wasn't on their property to begin with before, they can't trespass me. This is awesome. I'm Dragon T with Dragon Fire News, South Carolina. I'm doing a story. They called the cops on me because I had a camera. Constitutionally protected activity. Yeah, and it's a public, public property. Dragon Fire News, South Carolina, man. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. One for the people. Verizon Wireless had tried to have me trespass and get kicked off their property or removed from here because they uh, were upset that I had my camera on public property. Well, like I said, I'm doing a story.
story on this now because they refuse service. I wish I could be a fly on the wall for that conversation. in his case to stand a shame. Like I told the officers, at this point I'm not leaving until they leave. And they're pulling out now because they know they can't do nothing to me. Couldn't get my identification, couldn't get nothing. All they got was Dragon T with Dragon Fire News, and that was Unit 718 or 710, something like that. We'll get it when it comes back over here. That education was free today. Next time I'll have to charge you. Say something now?